this is the energy vibration reading for the Taurus Sun, Lunar Rising sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful new year, the 2020. Um, um, oh, wow. It is hot. Um, okay, so Taurus is, this is 2020. The energy for the year 2020 is the energy of uh, um, Happy New Year. I'm so sorry. I was off the line. Okay, so Taurus says the year 2020 is the year of the Eye Princess and the Omega. The Omega is the energy of the fool that is about giving you a new start. Bam! Taurus says. <laughs> okay. All right, Tauruses, this year is about the year of love for you guys, okay? So whoever asks a question when I just started, it's about love. You are, yes, you're going to be meeting your twin flame and soulmate. If you were asking about the person, it's a yes, whatever you were thinking. When you, when I just started, it is a yes, okay? Mm -mm -mm. Tauruses expect to meet your twin flame and soulmate in this year okay some of you could be getting um, married in this year Tauruses okay so as I was saying um, it is the year of new start but it is also the year of the eye princess and the Omega okay and that is about uh, portals you're receiving um to make new changes in your life the eye princess is about the intuition of the female goddesses that is coming in to help you um this fool is the energy of the circle and the number is um 20 20 is um two plus two is four so it's all about a good year for business for you tauruses okay it's a good year for business for you tauruses because you are the business people you are the the businessmen the business women you, you know business um there's different years for business um to happen and this is going to be one of the year for you tauruses okay so I see a lot of business. I see a lot of you could be um, buying properties in this year. So that is also coming up um, because you guys are always the one who is making money, helping people and showing people. So let's go in and check out what's coming up for you. Tauruses in the month of January, you Tauruses come in with the energy of the sun. Congratulations. So Tauruses, you're going to be successful in coming over issue in January. I see your successes coming up in January. I see if you weren't feeling well, it is going to be very positive because you're coming in and you're starting this year. You're leaving some negative situation behind. I see powerful alignment of energies. I see you moving forward. I see success is coming up for you Tauruses and you're starting the year 2020 on a positive note in the month of february the eye princess comes in this is beautiful it's wonderful the energy of the eye princess is the energy of the year also where the um the, your intuition you're going to be guided by your intuition in february this is a water energy so in february the emotions comes in and it is the energy of the eye princess so um, Tauruses, your intuition is as if uh, your guides are going to be there for you in the month of February, okay? And this is good. As we look at the month of March, secrets are coming out, another water energy, and I see that you are going to be um, connecting with your universal angels and guides, and they're going to be doing downloads in a month of February and March for you. I see unexpected information. If you're working with the Akashic Records, information could be coming out in the month of March. So wonderful energies you're starting off with this first quarter. In order to pick up the extended of this reading, please join the channel. And as you join the channel and choose for the super extended, that's where you receive everything, all the live show, all the super chats, all, yeah, just choose that one because there you're going to be picking up 
your year extended, your quarterly extended, your love extended for the year 2020. So you have to join and choose for super extended and there you can find all of your extendeds, okay? And this is for all the year through um, from now until December, there is changes on YouTube, but it is easier for me to upload all the extended because that's where they're always at. Okay. So your first quarter is a, is about, um, a, a lot of information, a lot of things that was kept behind a lot of information is going to be coming out. It's like January everything is just so powerful so much powerful alignment of energy in this first quarter go check out your first quarter reading especially the extended because it's going to give you a lot of information as we look at april i see the wheel of fortune coming in for you tauruses in the month of april the wheel of fortune is coming in and this is fabulous this is good um this is you tauruses are going to be aligned this is one of your lucky months, the month of April. This is powerful, really wonderful energies is coming in for you guys. It's fire in April and it's good fire because it's luck. That's your lucky month. May, we have the energy of judgment. Whatever the issue situation is, we see that in May, um, information is coming out for you guys in May. So um, this could be your spirit guides, universal angels, people from past life, your ancestral, bringing you some information in the month of May. Whatever it is, you can use it and uh, uh, it can help you. Um, in the month of, um, oh my God, the lovers come back. Oh my God. Okay. So in the month of uh, June, a lot of people are getting married, but a lot of people are meeting their twin flame and soulmate. Go back. If you have Libran in your birth chart, cause the Librans have this lovers in the month of June. Also, this is good. This is positive. Whatever that is happening for you june it's going to be fabulous it's a water energy but it's positive this in june you could be meeting a twin flame or a soulmate and this is going to be absolutely fabulous so your first six months of the year is looking good taurus i see you begin the year on a real positive note january is good april and june is good okay and this is fabulous we're going to be looking deeper as we look again a lucky month for you it is the month of july it is your own energy and this month of july is the energy of the elephant okay the energy of the elephants comes up for you tauruses so whatever you decide to do tauruses january april and july are going to be your best month of the year january april and july is going to be the best month of the year another earth energy the world is here in the month of uh, august august is going to be a fabulous month this is going to be good august you're ending a cycle with a corporation organization a business people and situation and august is bringing you unexpected information and you are going to use this information to end whatever issues you were having and this is going to be good in august as we look at september we see the energy of ego coming up now the energy of this ego could be having to deal with you or someone else you're dealing with and whatever the ego that was transpiring i seen a cycle bringing this to an end and it was with corporation institutes so it could have been your business that people who were um you know creating um situation you are bringing this to an end and this is going to be good so 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 this quarter is not a bad quarter um july and august is good i don't like the ego base but we need to see what is transpiring as we look at 
October. It's always this sort of an energy. October. I see you were dealing with a situation in September and in October. You have the energy of the hangman. Now you're going in to find out what exactly is going on. When the energy of the hangman is that you stand back and you are watching and observing things. Um, and you're not, it's in October. It's not a month to make any move. Don't make any, any decision in October, September and October for you Tauruses do not make any decision. As we look at November, the energy of the, the year comes up where in November, some of you Tauruses finally coming out of a situation and moving forward. This is looking good because you have a new chance. Your new chance Taurus is are coming up in the month of November. And this is absolutely fabulous because whatever that was transpiring with you, you Tauruses in the month of November is, this is the air. This is the first air energy that you um, Tauruses have received. And it's in the month of November pushing you forward. Last and final, the month of December is the energy of transition. Some um, situation is coming to an end. There was some ego base with your partner. You could have been divorcing. Whatever the ego basis is, is coming to an end in December. Whoever that was using their egos, this is going to be ending. This is a water energy and this is moving forward. You're moving forward on a positive alignment of energy. Whatever that has been transpiring with you, Taurus, is this year you're ending and removing all blockages. So you, Taurus, is we're dealing with blockages in your life. And it is a year where you're deciding these and these people and situation that create these things, I'm releasing them out of my life. And that is what you guys are doing is that you are picking up and handing situation, ending the blockages that was happening. I see a lot of secrets coming out about kids, whatever that was transpiring and happening. I see a lot of information coming out. Uh, um, it could be um, for kids, for some of you, but it could be um, for some of you is a new start. Okay. So if people situations were blocking your life, I am now seeing that a new start is going to be coming out for you Tauruses. And this is really wonderful and really beautiful. So whatever these new start, whatever these blockages that was transpiring and happening in your life, I see these energies is really coming out and a really positive alignment from energies is coming up. So let's go in and check out your year 2020 Tauruses. Remember, write this down. Go and check out the extended reading. You can only see it if you join my channel. And whoopsie daisy. Okay, there is a message for um someone out there. Um, organization and seeing the truth. Um, yes, um, the moon, the moon. So whatever is transpiring, I see that some of you, the moon is your enemies. Some of you are going to be finding out about your enemies. There you have some enemies. So, um, because this is happening, um, enemies, and it, it, it is showing you that some of you are going to be finding out your enemies um, in a corporation or organization. You have some enemies in a corporation or organization. Whatever is transpired, I see that some of you Tauruses are going to be finding out that you have some enemies either at the workplace or in your own company or in an organization or a corporation that is trying to block you. That is a message for some of you Tauruses out there. But I see that's what is being, you're going to be removing these, um, your enemies, the blocks that your enemies have set up for you. You're going to be removing these blocks in this year. Okay. So it's like breaking away from these negative forces and people in your life. That's what this year is all about for you Tauruses. So Let's let it there and um, let's see what is happening. 
So for the Tauruses in January going into February, I see you're receiving an offer. This is wonderful. So um, for you Tauruses, January is a wonderful year because if you're looking for a job or looking for a new offer, it's going to be coming in, okay? I see the doors and the portals are opening, and I see your spirit guides are helping you to move forward because um, some of you are going to be receiving a high promotional job, and it's going to be offered to you in January. In the month of February, going into March, I see you um, kind of watching, you know, it's as if you finish something. It's as if um, you have this good job, but you're still protecting yourself. You're not really open um, to people because it's as if your spirit guides are saying, listen, they're, you know, listen and watch because um, there is like, you know, you, you, you have successfully overcome, but you have created enemies. Okay. So Tauruses, be aware of this if you successfully come out of a situation in january be aware that you have created enemies and you need to watch out for these enemies just don't turn your backs to anything always observe and watch people and situation because i see you tauruses overcome a situation you have won and got out of a deceptive situation but it has created secret enemies so be aware of this tauruses as we look at april going into may um we have uh, the energy of the six of pentacles so april going into may i see the wheel of fortune bringing you some money or bringing you people who are going to be opening up doors of opportunities for you, Tauruses. And this is really looking good because money, you're going to be making money. Okay? You're going to be making money, Tauruses. It's a year where you're going to be making a lot of money. And the Wheel of Fortune is going to bring you all these positive balance um in your life i see love coming in some of you could be meeting someone in may that is the month of your birthday i see love coming in i see some of you could be meeting your twin flame or soulmate if you have met them before i think you're going to be asking them to marry you in june but new love is coming in some of you you this could be a new baby you could be pregnant you could find yourself being pregnant in the month of uh, may okay and i see some of you marrying in the month of june so offer of love is also coming up in the month of june i see some of you going to a wedding meeting someone and you're going to end up marrying to that person some of you are just protecting yourself i see some of you um you're not opening yourself to people you you are you're not giving everyone a, um you're not opening your hands to everyone and i think that that's best for you at this moment as we look at the next six months we see july going in august july going in august i see an issue with a family so there was some um some enemy in a corporation institute say i see some issues with a family whatever is transpiring i'm seeing some issues in the family um july going in august there is some issues with a family i see you guys could be having family issues um in august it's going to come to an end and it's um and then we see here um the ace of flamingo the ace of flamingo is that there was some deceptiveness at play and I th this is where you are finding out about people who were working against you so i see some deceptiveness at play i see some of you could go and investigate the situation or if there was an investigation that was happening against you it is now in um over i see the energy of the ego the the end of the lies the end of the ego-based people that you're cutting out of your life because you're bringing a tower moment down on them then we see the energy of the hangman which is a water energy 
water and here so the angman energy in november i see you standing your ground i see you're not leaving any stone turn you're standing your ground and that by doing that uh, i see you go within and try and figure out how can i balance out something and then in the month of uh, november you're going to be um understanding how to balance out something and this is good the truth is uh, you know some of you are turning your backs and walking away um, there was something that you weren't seeing. I see you turning your back and walking away from situation. I see you're blowing up situation, turning your back and walking away and bringing transformation in your life. And this is really good because what we're, what we're basically seeing here is that whoever that was keeping you blindfolded, you're ending this. Okay, you're ending this because it could be um, that you're trying to figure out and trying to resolve and find out who are these people and why were they keeping me blindfolded for whatever reason. And you're, you're, you're standing your ground and you're asking questions, especially when it comes to the last quarter of the year. You're standing your ground, you're asking questions and you want to know and you're trying to get through and see what is happening. Number two is going to be your energy vibration. I see a whole lot of you working, um, working from out duality. Um, and, and number two is uh, here. To number two is very strong where you're working um, through duality. Okay. So you Tauruses is actually using this year to work through duality. I see an, an, a lot of... Uh, a new love is coming in. I see you are going to be standing and communicating very well because you are trying to find out some deceptiveness that has transpired. The Pelagia Flamingo is that you are trying to find out what exactly took place. And, 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 and that is good. So duality is because you have... Um, the eye princess, you have offers, success offers is coming in. Duality is what you're working on in this year. Um, what I'm also seeing also, um, um, two and six is your energy vibration for the year 2020. Two and six, two is all about bringing balance and six is all about love and materialistic stability. Okay. I see... Um, a lot of you are finding out something about corporation, organization, institute. That is going to be coming in. So let's see for the Taurus, Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. What is coming up for you guys? So two and six is going to be an energy vibration. In January, you're successful with a situation overseas. Whatever that is transpiring, I see you very successful. It could be with a business uh, a situation. It could be that you open a business overseas. I see you very successful with this business deal. Uh, I see that success is going to be coming for you, Tauruses, overseas. So you could um, open another business overseas or you're receiving an offer overseas. So then we see um, the energy of an ending is coming in. And the ending is coming into the secrets, whatever secrets that was kept. I see an ending coming in in the month of um, uh, February. An ending is coming into the secrets and deceptiveness that has, was going on um, and you weren't aware. I see an offer coming in. I see some of you are connecting to the spirit world. The moon energies, I see some of you really connecting to your spirit guides in the month of March. Uh, but I see you turning. You're not, it's as if you want to find out uh, like how to manifest um, because you weren't aware of um, your spirit guides and that sort of a thing. But you're not going 100% deep in it. If you are in Akashic Records, I see the month of March, if you work with the Akashic Records or do anything with the Akashic Records, the month of March is going to be good for you guys. I see a deceptiveness, a theft, um, um, of some, a theft that it, 
is going to be happening in the month of April. Uh, Taurus, be aware of this. A theft is going to be happening in the month of April. It has to do with some money. In the month of May, I see you're going to be very successful finding out about the theft. What has transpired? I see you successfully finding out about the theft. The theft had something to do with some karmatic issue. I see you very successful in your birthday month, the month of May. I see offers. Success is coming in at work for you guys. Success in your business. I see success with offer a new love. You're going to be successful having a new love. Ladies, ladies, ladies with a starlight. The lovely starlight that bright so bright. You are meeting your twin flame and soulmate. So, ladies, mm, 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 new love is coming in in the month of June, ladies. Month of June, new love is coming in, ladies. And then we have some luck with a corporation organization that is coming in in the month of July. So, ladies, you're getting married in June. New love is coming in. Some of you, as I did say in the beginning, you're going to be um, going to a wedding and you're going to be meeting someone and end up marrying that person. I see you luck with your business, luck with um institutes the organization huge luck is coming in for you tauruses so i see the end to a, a deceptive a sly very sly situation that was happening it could be people from your work i see a cycle has been ended because an investigation had taken place they have found out that someone has done some sly things um and they are finding out but i see that you found out what has happened in your company. Let's say there was some deceptiveness in your company or um, in your department, and so you're finding this out. I see the clouds is on the energy of the devil. So this is the tower moment where negative forces in and an influence in your life is being removed in the month of September, Taurus. As we look at in September, October, I see the energy of you buying um, a new house. I see some of you buying a new business place, properties, that sort of a thing. This is definitely happening. I see you standing ground with an issue and a situation with a house. I see you standing up. Okay, there could have been um, you're building a house. Some of you are going to be building a house. And I see you standing your ground. You're going to be having luck with a house so um then we see some news coming in of a new start for you tauruses in the month of november so whatever that was transpiring i see news of a new start coming in in the month of november for you tauruses because you stand your ground against uh, injustice and deceptive things you stand your ground okay against injustice and deceptive things in the month of December, I see you overcoming and a transformation is coming in. Some of you could be changing your cars, but I see that some of you are definitely, definitely. So, Tauruses. Alrighty, Tauruses. So, love is going to be here in this year for you guys. There's no question. I see love coming up. I see an end to issues and situations. So love is really going to be coming up for you Tauruses in this year. So these are just like wonderful alignment of energies. So let's see what is coming up. Remember that your best month is January, April, some deceptiveness, but you're going to be overcoming the lies and deceptiveness, the theft that has transpired. Your luck is in the month of July for you. And it's also, um, July is going to be your month for you, um, Tauruses. July is definitely going to be the month for you guys. The last three months is a little bit like cleaning up, cleaning up and moving forward. So be aware of this, you Tauruses. It's like cleaning up and moving forward. Ladies, you're going to be meeting your twin flame and soulmate in this year. It is going to be a wonderful alignment of energies. 
So let's see what animals are coming up for the Tauruses in the year 2020. What animals are coming up for the, the Tauruses in the year 2020? I see the rat and you have the rat in your zodiac energy. The rat is here and I see the scorpions, okay? I see the rat and the scorpion. The scorpion is in the negative form. So be aware of this, the rat and the scorpion, but the scorpion is in the negative form. So let's see what is coming out. The energy of the rat is an air sign, okay? Whatever is transpiring, um, and it's kind of weird that the rat comes up because the rat should be basically an, uh, a fire sign. The rat is a fire sign, okay? Whatever is transpiring, the rat is a fire sign. The, the rat is an earth sign. The rat is an earth sign, okay? So whatever is transpiring, the rat, the mouse is an earth sign. So um, this is good, um, you Tauruses, and you have the rat stress and deceptiveness in the month of April. And the energy of the rat comes up, but he comes up in the upright position. Detail oriental, small minded, nickel pittle, nervousness. Be aware of this in this year. The mouse has an intimate desire to tend to the details. So if often spends it days finding and preparing, organizing and scrub and and, 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 and scripturing, unfortunately. A mouse personality doesn't notice when they're gone too far. Soon they begin to have a limit and a fair full vision of life. Try to control every details. This can be a quiet of a painful experience for both the mouse and those around them. When the mouse energy is at play, step back for a minute. It may be time to find a more pur a purposeful project to deliver into one that's worth your experience and your effort and your eyes resourcefulness when it's upright preparedness and this is good when it's out of balance busy with no purpose okay and to bring balance in is that you have to find a meaningful project so um taurus is whatever is happening in this year you got to be um, aware of your energies um, in this year, okay, um, we have the water energy and we have the scorpion. So um, some of you rat are dealing with some water energy um, and that is the energy of uh, the, um, the scorpion. So the scorpion carries the energy of water. Be aware of this, okay? Be aware of this, whatever is transpiring. Be aware of this, my darlings, because of whatever is transpiring. So, um, the scorpion is in the reverse, ladies and gentlemen. Whenever the scorpion comes up in reverse, it is not a positive energy. So, you gotta be aware of this. Uh, is the scorpion a fire sign? Yes, it is unbelievable yes the scorpion is a fire sign and it's in the reverse now the energy of the scorpion is passionate completing tend towards isolation okay the scorpion is passionate and determined creature their career is very important to them as um a few um selected friends sometimes the scorpion heats themselves up and they Focus on the unresolved event from the past. Usually a situation where they were left feeling burnt out. The scorpions call, call for it is time to come clean about your feelings so everyone can yield and you can get back to your usual self, okay? So when you're in balance, wide and free, flirting. When in the reverse, some of you... Um, Taur Tauruses are going to be having jealousy, resentment, and unresolved issues in your life, okay? To balance this, you got to be honest and forgiving, okay? So, 
Taurus says you got to be aware of your energies whatever is happening you gotta be aware of your energies whatever is transpiring Taurus says be aware of your energies and where you're focusing your energies okay let's see what is coming up for you guys I see um, attachments attachments so some of you Taurus could be attached to things that no longer serve you so be aware of where you and what you're attaching yourself to you could be attaching yourself to people in relationship and things don't that don't longer serve you so be aware of what you're dealing with and what you're attaching yourself to in this year okay then let's look at what is uh, the love psychic energy I see balance coming in for you guys so blue you're balancing the masculine and feminine side of you balance is coming up this is positive because this is a sister sign that is coming in to help you Tauruses this is wonderful because you're learning and you're learning to balance out uh, situations in your life and this is going to be blue good so I said to you guys love was coming in healing is coming in in relationship and love wonderful alignment of energies that is going to be transpiring for you Tauruses as we move forward and we are seeing again annual with balance and integrity so this angel of Atlantis is coming in in the year 2020 to help you Tauruses uh, to balance so twice the energy of balance comes up for you Tauruses so whatever is transpiring in your world you're going to be learning how to balance out these issues and this situation and it's going to bring you positive alignment of energy seeing that anyone come up with a balance I'm going to give you a phrase that you can always say um, when Archangel Annual comes up um, she comes up with integrity integrity is the name of the game in this year integrity there is need for you to take a look at the essential part of your life and notice of the integrity the focus of integrating within Archangel annual turn you turn on true challenges into opportunities for truthful um, assessment just as the eternal expansion path of life teaching that truths bring us to integrity and center us in life the Asian scale will be will always weigh your heart for truth please say a prior to Archangel Annuel who will help you to clarify any illusions and move you to what is absolutely pure within your soul say ra r a ma m a t t i m a r a so it is ramatimara 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 this is an asian atlantean chant that will strengthen you and bring you sacred clearing clarity and clearing your energy and you will feel blessed so this is wonderful and this is positive um Tauruses and remember it is R A space M A space T I space M A space R a okay so um Taurus is I love you guys for the extended of this reading um please um join the channel because you can't receive the extended if you don't join the channel and um choose for a super extended and there is where you can pick up the extended reading for this year reading I love you Taurus is so much please like and share these um um, messages for the year 2020 I will speak to you in the third uh, the first quarter <laughs> namaste mm -hmm.